Are you tired of lag, stutters, and low FPS in Fortnite Chapter 6? In this video, I'll show you exactly how I boosted my FPS to over 240 on a budget PC, using real tools, real tweaks, and no useless junk. Follow every step to fix lag, improve input delay, and make Fortnite run smoother than ever. So without wasting any time, let's get started. Step 1. Adjusting Windows Power Throttling settings for Fortnite budget PCs. If you're playing Fortnite on a budget PC, you want your computer to give you the best performance it can. One of the things that can slow your computer down is a setting called Power Throttling. To turn this off, press the Windows plus R keys together. A small box called the Run dialog will appear. In that box, type gpedit.msc and press Enter on your keyboard. This will open a window called the Local Group Policy Editor. On the left side of this window, go to Computer Configuration Administrative Templates. System now scroll down the list and find a folder named Power Management and click on it. Inside that folder, find Power Throttling Settings and double click on it. A new box will appear. In this box, look for the setting that says Turn Off Power Throttling and double click on it. Another small window will open. In this new window, select Enabled. This will completely turn off power throttling so that your CPU can always run at full speed. After that, click Apply, then click OK and close all the open windows. This works on both Windows 10 and Windows 11. Turning this off helps your computer run better and smoother while playing Fortnite. Gear Up Booster is a best tool to reduce your ping while playing games. It works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it for free from my description and enjoy smoother gameplay with lower ping. Step 2. Setting Fortnite Process Priority for Fortnite Budget PCs. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To give Fortnite better access to your CPU's power, we will change the process priority. This tells your computer to focus more on Fortnite. It helps Fortnite run smoother, especially on weaker PCs. First, open the folder called Fortnite Priority Manager that came with the optimization files you downloaded. Inside this folder, you will see three files. Fortnite Above Normal Priority. Fortnite High Priority, Fortnite Normal Priority, Default Windows Setting. If you are using a low-end or budget PC, double-click the file named Fortnite Above Normal Priority. If your PC is a mid-range or high-end computer, double-click the file named Fortnite High Priority. If you want to go back to the default setting, double-click the file named Fortnite Normal Priority. When you double-click any of these files, a message will pop up asking if you want to allow the file to make changes to your computer. Click Yes. The setting will be saved in your Windows registry. From now on, whenever you start Fortnite, it will run with this new priority setting. This helps reduce lag and improves performance while you are playing. Step 3. Improving CPU Performance by Unparking CPU Cores for Fortnite Budget PCs You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Sometimes your CPU doesn't use all of its cores in order to save energy. This is called parking. But when you are gaming, you want every CPU core to be working. To fix this, we will unpark the CPU cores. Start by downloading a tool called Unpark CPU. After you install it, right-click on the shortcut and choose Run as administrator so it has full access to your system. When the tool opens, it will show which CPU cores are parked, not being used, and which are active. Click the Unpark button to activate all the CPU cores. This lets your CPU use all its power and gives you better performance, which means more FPS and smoother Fortnite gameplay especially on budget PCs. Step 4. Using NVIDIA Profile Inspector Settings for Fortnite Budget PCs You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. If your PC has an NVIDIA graphics card, you can use a tool called NVIDIA Profile Inspector to get better FPS and reduce lag. This tool gives you access to advanced settings that are not shown in the normal NVIDIA control panel. First, open NVIDIA Profile Inspector and search for Fortnite in the list at the top. If you downloaded my custom settings file from Discord, you can import it to make this faster. If not, you can change the settings manually. Go to the anti-aliasing section and set transparency super sampling to 0x tetra 0 triple 0 8. Next, go to the texture filtering section and do the following steps. Turn on driver controlled LOD. Set both LOD bias DX and LOD bias OGL to plus 3. These settings will reduce some small details like grass and shadows, but they will help you get more FPS. Now set negative LOD, bias to clamp, and set texture filtering quality to high quality. Then go to power management mode and change it to optimal performance so that your GPU uses energy smartly. After doing all of this, click apply changes to save everything. These settings are great for making Fortnite run better on weaker systems. 
Step 5. Boost Windows Performance with Chris Titus Tech. Utility for Fortnite budget PCs. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To make your Windows system faster and clean up background stuff, you can use the Chris Titus Tech utility. This tool removes things running in the background that you don't need and helps lower CPU usage. First, open your FPS boost pack and find the text file that has a special command inside it. Open that text file and copy the full line of code inside. Now go to the Windows search bar, type PowerShell, right-click it, and choose Run as administrator. Then paste the command you copied into PowerShell and press Enter. This will launch the Chris Titus Tech Utility Tool. Click on the Tweaks tab and you will see several performance options. Choose the minimal preset if you want to safely remove extra Windows features. Choose the standard preset if you want stronger tweaks to improve performance more. The tool will automatically make a system restore point before making any changes, so you can go back if anything breaks. After choosing your preset, click Run Tweaks and wait for it to finish. Then close the tool. These tweaks help lower background activity, reduce CPU usage, and boost your Fortnite FPS. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping while gaming. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the end tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let gear up automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally close the window and launch your game using gear up booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 6. Use MSI Utility to optimize hardware performance for Fortnite budget PCs. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Great way to make your hardware work better and reduce input delay is by using MSI Utility. This tool helps your hardware communicate better with Windows. After downloading and opening it, you will see a list of your PC's hardware components. Find your GPU, tick the MSI box next to it, and set the interrupt priority to high. Then find your integrated GPU, like Intel Graphics, tick its MSI box, and set its interrupt priority to high too. Click Apply to save everything and then close the tool. These settings make your system run more smoothly and reduce stutter and input lag while playing Fortnite. Step 7. Improve CPU performance. Using Throttle Stop for Fortnite budget PCs, you can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To boost your CPU even more, use a program called Throttle Stop. First, open the Tools folder on your PC, then open the Throttle Stop folder. Double-click to open the Throttle Stop program. When it opens, you'll see power modes like Performance, Game, Internet, and Battery mode. Pick the Game Power Plan and check the box that says High Performance. This will give you the best performance while gaming. Now look for options like Clock Mode, Set Multiplier, and Speed Shift settings. Don't change anything in those. Just check the box for Disable Turbo so that your CPU doesn't overheat. Click Turn On, then click Save. Keep throttle stop running in the background while using your PC to keep your system fast and steady during gaming. Step 8. Unlocking all CPU processors for maximum performance for Fortnite budget PCs. Sometimes your PC does not use all your CPU cores when starting up. We will change that so Fortnite can use all the CPU power. First, press the Windows key, search for System Configuration, and open it. Go to the Boot tab and click Advanced Options. In the new window, check the box that says Number of Processors and choose the highest number in the dropdown. This is how many CPU cores your PC has. Click OK, then click Apply and close the windows. This lets your PC use all its CPU cores right from startup, which helps with faster game loading, less lag, and smoother Fortnite performance.